today, I'm going to show you on how to do the Western Union Long Thai Choi. We will be needing two pieces of wire. We have to position the wire in a cross position just like this and twist the wire. Right now, I am using my bare hand in twisting the wire. But if you find it difficult, you may use the combination pliers to hold the wires. We have to hold the wires firmly so that the wires will not slide. Right now, I am using two combination pliers to twist the wire. After finishing 6 to 8 twists, you will notice that it looks like a rat tail joint. Now, we are going to fix the wire. Bend the other wire upward and the other wire horizontally, just like this. And then, we are going to loop the bare wires into the other conductor. Again, I am using my bare hands. While, while twisting it, you have to check if it is correctly looped into the wire. Now, if you find it difficult, again, you can make use of the combination to loop the wire. You may also use the long nose pliers in doing this. All the wires must be completely looped, just like this. Now, we are going to do the same on the other side. Again, we can make use of our combination pliers to help us grip the wire. And, we can also make use of our combination pliers to loop the wires or the long nose pliers. Again, we have to finish the wire completely. And we are almost done. Okay. Twist just a little bit more. 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 And ta-da! Now we are done with our Western Union long tie joint. See? It is easy, right? Now it is your turn to do it. 